Seven Azam Uganda Premier League matches will be played across the country, but the Kampala Derby at the Philip Mond Stadium in Lugogo will top the bill. KCFC may be the hosts of tomorrow's eager and spated derby, but Express FC don't intend to play the role of intimidated visitors. We don't have this saying that the team is away, uh, we shall be intimidated, the field is small, something like that. No, we don't believe in such because we have, always, we have grown up playing from such fields uh, like Lugogo, Wankulukuka and all other fields. Good enough, we have enough experience that can really help us to play a, a game of such a magnitude of KCC versus Express. I know they're a good team, they have a good coach, they have um, experienced players as we do, but uh, whoever will use his chances tomorrow will be winning the game. Derby matches between KCC FC and Express FC are usually too close to call. Last season both games ended in one all draws. Players from either side agree that tomorrow's match is anyone's call. I think it's going to be an open game because uh, Honestly speaking, we're going, to, we're going to play a very offensive game tomorrow, uh, looking at our, our game plan for tomorrow, and I think the same thing is going to happen with Express. We have to do all we can to make sure that maybe they don't win tomorrow, because if they win, they'll go uh, about uh, six points ahead of us, so we have to make sure that maybe we win, th then we can reduce on the gap between us. KCCFC seem to be intent on using the francs, but Express has promised not to make things easy for them. Ours is a solid attack building. We try to build from the back and we, and we try to emphasize wing plays, uh, which will favor the likes of uh, Robert Sentongo and Geoffrey Seron Kuma. If those balls come in, I think we stand a, a big chance against Express tomorrow. We are not going to allow KCC to play from the midfield. Uh, we shall be forcing them to play through the, the flanks and then we cross them down and we make sure that we can get them on the break to make sure that maybe we can have a, uh, a point more. Express FC coach Alex Jeter says his side could strive going into the game as underdogs. We have one, two, one or two things. One, to restore the trust of, the, of our fans. Two, to prove to the world that Express is a club that is ready and set to play and challenge for a silverware. Express FC also hopes to bank on the technical advice provided by a Chinese football analyst who helped the six-time champions beat Vipers 1-0 in their last league match. Elsewhere, SC Villa hosts Soana at Nambole. Sadolin Paints make a short trip from Jinja to Gazi to face URFC, while police faces off with the Saints at Kavumba in Wakiso. Jinja Municipal Council Hippos take on Proline in Kakindu as Vipers look to get back to winning ways in Wankurukuku where they face Reza FC. Sam Poza, NTV Sport.